Welcome my people to a new video from AI Made Tech Reviews. It's been a long time since I've recorded from the car. You know that this is based on motivation, and when the days are very busy with work to relax in traffic, I play podcasts from different programs from the Dominican Republic. And if the day is slow at work, I listen to the podcast during the day, and on the way home I record these vlogs. It's already starting to get hot. I like this. I like the heat. Well, I don't like it that much, but I like it more than the cold. What is the current temperature, more or less? And what are we going to talk about? Today we are going to talk about a topic that I wanted, but now I am going to talk about it here in a video for the record. Not only to have it in the future for me, but for all my relatives, my daughters, and everyone. For when I leave, this will be there so that they can see who I was and how I thought when I was alive. People think that I do all this to gain subscribers and make money only, or maybe to be famous, but no. One of my main interests in making vlogs is to give my future generations an idea of who I was, and for them to see me with a voice and an image. I would like to have a video I have already told my sister of my father, and talking about the issues that he handles, something like a small interview so that I can remember it in life, and remember it in a video that is captured there, that I, I could repeat it a million times if I wanted to. And well, today's topic, we are going to talk about being head of the family, because with feminism, the idea of head of the family has changed a lot, and that is the difficult part of finding a partner that has the same meaning that we have. We believe that he who is the head of the family has to be the head of the family in absolutely everything, as if there were no middle ground. It is regularly thought that he who is the head of the family is in charge of the economic part. He is in charge of decisions related to children. He is in charge of jobs and ventures. He is in charge of everything. I have a slightly contrary idea with that. I have had many ups and downs at a professional level and then I am with my wife. We have been together for many years, but we have been formally married for 10 years. But you have to understand that even that head of the family is something that one has to know how to delegate. When we lived in the Dominican Republic, the head of the family was me, that is, I was in a country where I knew how everything was done. I was the one who had a better salary. I was the one who had a better position. I was the head of the family. Everything changed when I arrived here. The one who automatically became head of the family was my wife. But I mean, she was my wife at that time, but not because of the economic part. She became head of the family because she was the one who took the lead at that time, and she was the one who could solve the problems alone. Medical appointments, business, interviews, etc. She managed all of that then. At that moment, she became the head of the family, although I was the one who worked and kept the money in the house. In my house, the decisions were made by her because she was the most competent person at that time. She was the most qualified at that time to be head of the family. So being head of the family is even a role that can be delegated. I am the head in everything that has to do with mechanics, electronics, electrical, repairs, everything that has to do with that kind of activities in the house. Obviously, she tells me what she needs and I do it based on her needs, but I make the suggestions and actions, although I know they are based on her needs, I do them. And in that sense, the head is me. But everything that has to do with medical appointments, everything that has to do with paperwork, like having all the monthly bills, pending, taxes, shopping at the supermarket, among other things, I don't get involved in that. That's your thing. Because that is what she likes, and in that she is head of the family. In that aspect, I do as she tells me. I do not agree with this fight that exists now. Some people think that whoever works the most and whoever brings the most money to the house is the head of the family. The expression, I earn more than you. It has separated too many families and as I just said, the head is not the one with the highest salary or the one who brings the most money to the house. You have to know how to delegate. You have to know what you are good for, what you are not good for. What does your partner have to do? 
I believe that in a couple, everyone should do what they do best. And let's be completely open to understand that if you can't do something and your wife can't do something, and you as a couple need outside help from a professional in any area, there is, you have to have a cool head to know that you can't do everything. If you have to look for help outside and that help can solve a problem, look for help. This is what I wanted to say about being head of the family. I wanted to remain here for my future generation so that they have a guide and know how I think in that sense since sometimes one makes the mistake of looking for a partner. We want things to be as if written on paper and to be super clear to the point that no one can deviate from what is written on paper. I remember when my wife gave birth to my last daughter, she had to go back to the hospital due to a complication, and I had to stay and manage my three daughters, Alexia, who is the oldest and the two youngest. I became active and I learned things that I didn't do or that I didn't know, responsibilities that I had no idea about. All of the girls' activities that were written as if it were a shopping list were done one after another. And I complied, because at that moment I had to stand up for my family and obviously resolve. When my wife recovered, she took back the reins of certain activities in the house. At home, we have divided tasks. We no longer have to tell anyone what they have to do or what they shouldn't do. There are things that my wife has to do, that when she can't do them, I don't expect her to have the time to do them. I do them and vice versa. And little by little, I understood that this is what the head of the family is. You have to know how to delegate and you have to be sufficiently clear and responsible about the activities that everyone has to do at home. And well, a topic a little outside the topics that I regularly talk about. But if you like this video, give it a like. Share it if you think it can be useful to someone else. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel.